morning guys can't really see the camera sorry about that it's, uh, sun's awful bright coming up this morning uh, out here on a little paddle trying to get used to this boat it's uh, started out kind of rough had uh, some racing paddlers we're, uh, we're out here and their uh, their coaches are in motorboats and uh, it's uh, me being a novice canoeist motorboats ain't very good for me and, uh, I do hope that nobody thought that I've been doing this for years because I ain't I am quite the novice at this. I'm out here this morning trying to get used to this boat. I, uh, when I came through last time, we, uh, you know, I'm having to paddle it backwards because uh, that's the way you do it. That's the way you, you paddle a tandem canoe solo. And, uh, Kind of cut off circulation in the back of my legs, so I mentioned a friend of mine that uh, thought about getting some stadium seats or getting a stadium seat and try it, see if that would help out. And it is a lot more comfortable, but even though it's only an inch or so higher, it seems to make the boat a lot more tippy and. Uh, so I'm having to kind of stay on edge for that. But it is a beautiful morning. It's a great morning to be out here. I'm hoping that uh, GoPro does better this morning. It, uh, it recorded a little bit of footage. I was actually able to go back and, and retrieve the footage from last time, but I, it wasn't very much, so I went ahead and deleted it. Um... Uh, I don't know, y'all just uh, hanging here with me. Maybe I won't be too boring to paddle around. And uh, hopefully I won't flip this thing over. But, uh, boy, that sun's bright. Probably won't take a lot of footage going this way. But uh, coming back, I'm sure it'll be absolutely gorgeous with the sun to my back. And, uh, Y'all, uh, I say, hang in here with me, and uh, we'll uh, we'll try and paddle around a little bit. Water seems to be settling down after the motorboats are, have left out, and uh, and we'll uh, we'll try to have a little fun.
so far so good been uh been trying to do some different stuff i was uh pulled up over here by the dock to uh see if i could maybe kneel and paddle no that won't work not on my messed up foot um Anyhow, I still got a lot of figuring to do, figure this thing out. I'm, uh, I'm propelled. I'm doing good with moving along. I think that uh, once I get some weight in here, maybe get uh, get somebody else in here with me, start doing this thing tandem. It'd probably be a little easier, but uh, I need to get used to it by myself. I can't worry about uh, going tandem, but uh, you know the, the trip's going to be good because we, it will be tandem and this thing will be loaded, and we'll probably have about 50, 60 pounds of gear on it. I guess I don't know. Uh, I know that my gear is around 20 to 30 pounds, and uh, well, it was. Way, cheap, way lighter than that when I hike, but I'm gonna carry a little extra stuff since we're gonna be canoeing and we ain't got a tote it. Um, seems like the GoPro's doing okay. Hope that the footage works out well with it. Um, I think I'm going to. Uh, I don't know, I might do some more footage. I'm gonna go on the other side of the bridge and see what's over there. But, uh, anyhow, sorry I'm not uh, doing a lot of video this trip. I'm just trying to try and learn this thing. Done all the watched all the videos. I know I, I can sit down and take a book test and tell you everything there is to know about a canoe. But I cannot. I, I've, I've got to put it to, to wisdom. You got to put that knowledge to wisdom and uh, get to know this thing physically. And, uh, so, y'all hang in there with me. It's a lot of fun, really. I mean, I know you sense the frustration in my voice. It is a little frustrating, but well, when you get lined out just thing moving out through there it is sweet and it's absolutely beautiful being out here this time of the morning but uh, i'm glad that the, the competitive rowers went on took their power boat with them let this thing settle out but it's turned into an absolutely beautiful morning but, uh, I can't see myself in the camera, so I don't know what I look like. The sun's too bright. But, uh, I, uh, again, I hope I'm not boring you too bad. Let's get out here and play some more.
GoPro's recording. This is birdie boy. I think I recorded when I come through a while ago. I'll find out when I get home. So I came back through. Give it another shot. See ahead of me there. Normally the trail that I'm hiking. I'm walking on. The rigor and I'm walking on. And we may be doing that in the morning. I might have to take him to the vet today, though. I don't know. He's uh, limping around. I'll find out when I get there. Well, I sure hope that uh, this video comes out okay. I uh, just got loaded up from sweat, a little bit out of breath. Canoe's heavy, like 80 pounds. But uh, then you gotta climb all over the truck, strap her down. But at any rate, that was fun. I learned some stuff. There, uh, with that seat, I learned that you just have to sit back and relax, not fight it, and it works out a lot better. I, uh, I think I was fighting it too much to begin with, but man, it took me a minute to, just to kind of give up because it, it changes your center of gravity and uh, really makes the tippy plus the, that darn boat, power boat running up and down through there with them coaches and that was made it, made it kind of kind of iffy but I'm learning I'm starting to enjoy it a lot more and uh, starting to relax be a lot less anxious and uh, and this this is going to be phenomenal whatever we're uh, get this thing down pat but uh, anyhow I'm gonna, I think the vet's open by now it's five minutes after nine been out here since uh, about seven 7.30 paddling around enjoying the, enjoying the morning and becoming one with a canoe but uh, yeah it's a, this is going to be a fabulous ride when I, when I get it learned and uh, thank y'all for coming along with me and uh, kind of putting up with me in my, my craziness We'll, uh, we'll get this thing down pat and maybe I'll be able to put out some good videos on the one I do at any rate need to uh, I said need to see if uh, vet's open if Ruger's not doing any better when I get home and uh, he's limping on that old leg I thought he had a hot spot it may just be a hurting and cause him to lick it till the hair come off of it. But anyhow, we'll uh, we'll get it figured out. And uh, in the meantime, y'all get out and have yourself an adventure. And as we say in Mountain Bushcrafters Alliance, go farther and stay longer. Thank you. Thank you very much.